Hey, he, she's, and they's. It's Victory the Vague. It rhymed. So I'm pretty proud of myself that it rhymed. So, hey y'all. Um, back with another video. Didn't really make anything yesterday because I did nothing yesterday. And, like, as much as my, as much as I want to share my life, I don't want to bore you all. You know what I mean? So, I usually try my best to save something. You know, record something for something's sake. You know what I mean? I know what I mean. Um, today at work, it was pretty good, pretty solid. Um, didn't really do much. Well, personally, I say I don't, didn't do much, but that's because there wasn't a lot of people. Yes, it was a Saturday night, so there still was a good amount of people, but, um, it wasn't as much as I'm used to, because it's usually really, really busy, but for some reason it was really not it really dropped off after like a certain time but i know for sure it was like way earlier than the one i'm used to but yeah that was work nothing special taking orders doing the thing doing the job a lot of people tell me that i'm nice but that's because i absolutely hate it <laughs> like because i'm on i do customer service i'm I have a really good customer service voice so good that people think that i love my job the answer is i hate doing my job so I really push myself to act like or look like I love my job. I don't. So CKS, you know what I mean? Somebody was like, oh my god, you must really love your job. And I was like, no, what makes you say that? <laughs> like with my customer service voice, I was like, no, my goodness, what makes you say that? And she's like, because you're so happy right now. I was like, no, I, have, I absolutely hate my job. Thank you for coming. Did you want any ketchup? Like that, that was the vibe. And I felt bad, but I was like. I'm not gonna lie to somebody that I don't know, you know what I mean? <laughs> if I know you, I'm gonna lie to you, but <laughs> if I don't know you, I'm not gonna lie to you, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, that's that was my work day today. Um, song of the day, bro. I've been obsessing, obsessing over Nacho Nacho from RRR. It's a super good movie that's won like a lot of good, um, that's won a lot of awards and stuff. And honestly, I watched it with, like, nothing going in. I did not read any of, like, the synopsis or, like, a summary. I had no idea where it was from, who it was by, uh, what the story was about. All I just went in and was, like, pure blind. I was like, let me watch this. Somebody recommended it to me. Let me watch it. And I watched it. Mind blown. First five seconds, I was like, what am I watching? This is weird and funny and awkward and, like, really in my face. You know what I mean? Blatant. It's very blatant. And, like, as the story went on, the story building, the problems, the <laughs> the feelings, the vibes, the little, the cliches. I don't mind the cliches. The cliches are good if you do a really great way of retelling a cliche, in my opinion. Cliche is a cliche because it works. <sighs> If it doesn't work, it's not a cliche. You know what I mean? Like, it's one and done, never doing that again kind of situation. Um, and yeah, really recommend RRR. Good story. Brotherhood. Vibes. Yes. And then the Nacho 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 is like such a good song. It hypes. It hypes. It has the hype, bro. But yeah, that's that. Um, on other news, today I went shopping. Bought some groceries. Came out to like $74. I could be lying. I say seventy four because um I also took like a I took out twenty dollars so I could go to the little um I have a pulga there's a pulga next to my um job at Waterburger. Um there's a pulga and I went today just to like scope it out and I was like this is nice so let me show you. I've got this really nice check it shirt, check her out, but um but check her out, ladies and gentlemen. Really nice checkered shirt, if I do say so myself. It's gonna go some. It's gonna go really nice. Sorry, I'm not gonna do that anymore. But it's gonna go really nice with like my zipper pants. I don't know who watches my stuff, but if y'all ever want me to show you my fits, let me know. Leave something in the comments. I doubt it, or send me a message or something. I don't know. I don't know, but one day maybe I'll start showing my fits once I, like, start getting stuff together, you know? Once I get my computer and stuff and I can actually make edits on my videos instead of, like, 
doing these one-liners and just going 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 you know what i mean and that'd actually be funny <laughs> you know what i mean and this really nice shirt they're all long sleeves though it's my only problem at the moment but this shirt really cool i love the blocking it's giving blue color but i'm <laughs> i'm funny i promise i promise i'm funny that one's cool i only got like four shirts they were like five bucks each way cheaper than what i would have gotten at goodwill y'all know y'all know and this one is like <sighs> it's giving the <me> biscuit <laughs> But yeah, and it's Dickies, and this one's cool. Again, five bucks. It's giving also um bowler hat. No, not bowler hat. Bowling, bowling vibes. You know, I'd wear these with bowling shoes and stuff. It's nice, emo, edgy. Hashtag emo. And then of course, like a really good black shirt. You know, just to have like a good black shirt, because all of my other ones are like me you know what i mean now but yeah a good black shirt honestly you just have to really look at the bruda you know and there were some other ones i found like a really nice um a really nice sweater vest i like sweater vests they go well i don't know i like the vibe especially when i change up my hair and then like i try to like match mix match but yeah they had a really nice sweater vest but i only brought 20 bucks and i got four shirts five bucks per shirt that's not bad i think in my opinion for 20 for four four shirts it's not bad and good shirts too we got dickies tommy hilfiger figure figure out i don't fucking care oh we got beverly hills polo club made in bangladesh no these are good quality shirts and i feel like no and i know they're gonna last me you know Rustler by Wrangler for five bucks, bro. Shoo! Yeah, Tommy Hilfiger. Yeah, you just gotta look. Especially here in Laredo. I'm kind of lucky that there's an untapped fashion thing. Like, my fashion taste is very niche here. If we were, like, in San Antonio, everything that I like would be gone. You know what I mean? But yeah, well that was my day today. I really gotta go to bed. It's like twelve fifty already, and I work at nine. You do the math. I'm not gonna do it. And yeah, appreciate y'all for stopping by. Um, remember, free Palestine. Um, do what you gotta do. Be better than you were yesterday. And that's about it. Y'all have a good one. Love y'all. And remember, keep making friends. Thanks! <laughs>